In my work, I believe that the uh, 2012 date was an intentional placement. We see this just by virtue of the simple fact that it falls on a solstice. But there's another thing going on here with December 21st of 2012. This date identifies the era when the position of the December solstice sun is lining up with what astronomers call the galactic equator. It's the cross of the Milky Way in the ecliptic, which the ancient Maya thought of as the sacred tree. And it's also near the dark rift in the Milky Way, which the Maya conceived as the Shabalba Bay, the road to the other world. According to the only existing reference to that specific date, the day the planet is exposed to that rift in the galaxy is also the date that a visitor from that other world is expected to return here. The evidence that we have in the Maya world for 2012 really comes from one place. It comes from one tablet, uh, from a site called Tortuguero, which uh, no longer exists. Though such inscriptions usually celebrate the sitting kings and imagine the gods smiling on them in the present and future, surprisingly, there is one fragment of the stone at Tortuguero that looks almost 2,000 years into the future. They don't say what 2012 is about. They don't say why it's important. There's no description of what will happen. The only thing the text does say is that a god, Bolong Joktekuk, who is the god of destruction, will descend to his home or temple on that very date. 